Let's start the installation with a filling of the lubrication cup. It should be filled with approximately 100 milliliters of plasticizing oil, for example, DOTP. Hydraulic oil should conform to DIN standard 51524.1 or 2. For example, ISO VG46. Fill is each tank with approximately 18 liters of hydraulic oil. We recommend to fill the tank of the EC hydraulic machine with oil up to the level shown on the picture, which corresponds to 18 liters of the fluid. Electrical network should correspond to the following parameters. Connection 1 16 amperes at 1 phase 230 volts and 50 Hz for 20 meter heated hose version. Connection 2 16 amperes at 1 phase 230 volts and 50 Hz. Install the air dryer on the tank of ISO. Do not forget to extract and discard red protective plugs of the dryer. Open the leads of the tanks and fill them accordingly with the products corresponding to each tank. Be careful not to spill a product while doing so. If this happened, wipe it well and grease the thread of the ISO tank's lead. Do not fill the tanks with more product than shown, maximum 30 liters. Take the fast lock connector out of the gun box and fasten it on the air hose of the product hose as shown. Connect the 20 meter section of heated hoses to the machine. Do not over tighten these connections to the machine. Connect the electrical cable of heated hoses to the slot located on the external side of the electrical box of the machine, as shown.
connect the purple TSU wire to the machine and fix it with tape as shown. Extract the TSU from its box and extend the probe carefully. Insert the TSU probe into the 20 meter hose section and tighten it firmly. Connect the extender on polyl hose and tighten it firmly. Connect the TSU wire to the corresponding connector and fix it with a tape in a compressed position as shown. Connect the respective sections of 65 cm of non-heated hoses to the TSU and the extender and tighten them firmly. When fixing wires with tape, make sure to fix the tissue flexible protection in a compressed mode as shown. Take the gun and disconnect the coupling block. Connect the coupling block to the free ends of 65 cm non-heated hose and tighten them firmly. No mistake can be made as the threads have different size. Protect the TSU area with flexible covers. Fix it as shown and wrap it with protective fabric. Cut the scuff jacket in the area of TSU if necessary. Overlap scuff jackets in the areas of hose connections and secure them with a tape. Compressor recommended 3 and a half HP, one phase 230 volts from 300 to 3 
550 liters per minute air output and 100 liters receiver. Extract the plug from the receiver and connect the air hose supply directly as shown. Connect the air hose assembly supplied via fast lock connector to the air hose of the compressor. Take the fast lock connector out of the gun box and fasten it on the air hose of the product hose as shown. Take the gun and the short piece of air hose out of the gun box. Connect the air hose to the gun as shown. Open both product inlet valves located beneath product tanks. Turn the main switch on. The LED will light. Press control power button. The control panel will be activated. Press motor button. The LED will light and the motor will be activated. Press normal button. The machine will activate dosing pump's movement. Keep holding the coupling block above the waste containers and open both respective manual valves. Let the products out of the coupling block unless oil residues and air bubbles have left the circuit completely and pure products appear. Press retract button. The LED will light and the dosing pumps will move into parking position. Close both coupling block valves and clean the coupling block from all product residues. Close in that valve. Turn the main switch off. The display will go out. The machine is ready for work. We recommend to fill the tank of the EC hydraulic machine with oil up to the level shown on the picture, which corresponds to 18 liters of the fluid. The lubrication cup should be filled with approximately 100 ml of DOTP. Make sure the tanks have been filled with products. Do not fill each tank with more than 30 liters of product. Open both product inlet valves located beneath product tanks. Check technical data sheet of the products. Turn the main switch on. The LED will light. Press control power button. Press the button mode, adjust the requested ISO and polio heaters working temperatures. Press the button mode, adjust the requested heated hose working temperature and set 4.5 amperes of amperage. Press hoses, LED will light and 4.5 amperes appears on the amperage screen. Press heaters buttons, both LEDs will light. Wait until all the temperatures reach their set point and press the button motor. Press the button normal. Rotate the hydraulic pump wheel clockwise until product pressures reach the required value. Connect the gun to the coupling block and the air. Open manual valves Set the gun safety valve in working position Press the trigger and make a trial spray Make sure the working pressures get equalized 